All right, so we're going to talk about another herb today, which is a very, it's a very interesting one. Okay, this is called the sun opener, or are you ready for the full name? Hemia salicifolia. Okay, the sun. We'll just call it the sun opener, right? This is a herb which is very important for a lot of tribes use this herb to induce very powerful visions. It's been used for thousands of years, but only recently have the, has the Western world sort of realized that it exists and sort of learned about its benefits and uses. And so that's what caught my eye um, about this particular herb, the sun opener. Now there's a bit of sort of cliche, new agey type stuff associated with this herb. A lot of people report that they take it and they're instantly connected with their astral guide or their spirit guide or wanderers and things like this. Now I can't personally attest to that um, because I've not yet managed to try this herb so I can't give any personal experience on you know how it works on you. What I'm going to do is just in, you know, explain a bit about the history, the benefits, how it works, the uses and things like that and then you can make up your own decision. I don't think there's any uh, massive side effects to this you know that there's obviously side effects to things like galantamine but this is a more natural herb okay this is a fairly natural substance you know this is a, it's a herb it's a plant right so it grows in the ground sun opener is found in parts of America it's found in parts of America mainly southern America uh, Central America and Mexico and places like that it needs a very hot climate in order to grow so you won't often find this sold at local stores. This is quite a rare or hard to come by supplement or herb. Mexican shamans have been using this for a long time uh, to induce visions, to know what to do, to like seek guidance from something higher, whether that's a place in their own mind or if you believe that it's a place somewhere else outside of your own mind. The shamans have been using this, the sun opener, uh, for a long time to get those types of visions. It's said to have supernatural powers. Now again, I don't know how much of this is actually true. I will be testing it soon. I'm gonna try and get hold of some uh, some sun opener, some sun herb, we'll call it the sun herb. Uh, it's actually called the sun herb or the sun opener because of the idea of it being able to induce these visions, but also because it has these yellowy flower type things, these bright yellow flower buds that are about two centimeters wide. Now the traditional way of actually making this is it's ideally used as a drink, like a, a sort of a hot drink or a tea, is you would actually let the yellow flowers themselves wilt and die and then use what's left of that to brew a tea. Uh, you know, the, the best way of doing it is to actually ferment the flowers uh, for about 24 hours or so, 24 to 48 hours, and then to add boiling water to them and drink it as a tea type mix, like a tincture. Now, interestingly, one of the key ingredients here, the most, the, one of the active ingredients of the sun opener, is a substance which, which mimics the effects of dopamine and adrenaline, which are also feel good hormones, or you know, things that make us feel alive and buzzing and happy, uh, which obviously explains why it's quite pleasurable and common for shamans to take this herb. Okay, and the active ingredient that does that is called phenylalanine. Again, these are very long, complex names. You don't really need to know this, but I think that's how you say it. Phen phenylalanine is the active ingredient which mimics dopamine and adrenaline. So the actual effects, right? What's it gonna feel like when you take this? The first reported effects are that your muscles relax. Okay, so much like when you do meditation, your muscles will start to relax and you'll sink into a deep state of consciousness and relaxation. Then you will start feeling a sort of a euphoric type high or like a, almost a hallucination type state, hallucinogenic type state, before going into the proper vision state, which I'll get into in a second. So interestingly, obviously it's called the sun opener because of the yellow leaves, but people also report seeing like a yellow tint to the things that they actually hallucinate about, which is kind of, I find that really interesting. It's able to influence the colors you see and put sort of like a filter of yellow over what you're seeing. One of the most fascinating effects of this supplement or this herb is that after you, so you go through a hallucinogenic state, then you get the yellow tint type effect where everything you see is like gold or yellow. And then after that, people report being able to remember things from years ago, things that they didn't even know that they had in their memory. And it's able to unlock these memories and just have them open to you. So you can just you can look at your memories almost like a book, and you can you can remember these experiences and these things that you've you've done or, or heard or seen that you had no idea you remembered. And I find that fascinating. The ability of the human mind is just so interesting. Uh, and so that is probably one of the reasons I would try it, is to just try and unlock some of those memories that I might not even know I have. And I find that very, very interesting. Fortunately, there aren't actually any side effects to the sun opener, as far as I can see. It seems to not affect your energy levels. There's no sort of lingering after effects the next day. There's no tiredness, there's no fatigue, and there doesn't seem to be any tolerance issue issues either. The only problem, I guess, is it's quite hard to get. Um, there's not any real 
sort of brand or company that's offering it or selling it directly. And even if they are, they, they tend to go out of stock very quickly or have stock issues or have very much, like they have trouble with being reliable. So what I would say is I'm gonna put a link in the description to a more detailed review that I wrote about this uh, Hamia Salifonica, the sun opener. Uh, you can actually get you can actually get some liquid extracts of this now on Amazon, uh, but again I'll put the links to the best places to get this herb or this supplement in the description. So make sure you check that out. Leave a comment letting me know what you think if you've tried this. I doubt you have because it's it's not very common. I don't I don't think it's very common. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys. This video and this channel are supported by my Patreon followers. Please consider giving just a dollar a month to support this channel. Or just click the links in the description, you'll find links to various Lucid Dreaming products, articles, techniques, and tutorials. If you did enjoy this video, please click the notification bell and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Why are you still watching this? You should have clicked one of my related videos by now, right? Or subscribed, or gone onto my website, or something like that.